friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Train Fever. Uh, in an unexpected move, a year to the date, more or less, uh, that the game came out, uh, the developers have released a new patch. Uh, so, as well as uh, kind of progressing our uh, our playthrough here, we're going to uh, going to look at the, the the couple of major changes that this patch made. Uh, fortunately, the the first of which doesn't affect me, or at least it doesn't affect me retrospectively. It, I mean, it, I've been playing by the rules already, and that change is change. Get my teeth in there. Uh, that change is that uh, all trains have to have an appropriate uh, uh, wagon for for whatever goods it is that they're carrying, and that's fine. Uh, you know, I'm already running. Uh, I'm, I'm only running two. Uh, uh, cargo lines as it is. Uh, the first of which is carrying lumber, as <laughs> as you can see. Uh, the second of which is carrying oil, uh, and obviously the oil requires a tanker. The uh, the lumber requires a state car, and I've already got those fitted. Um, so you know that's that's all well and good. That's they've they've said it's to promote realism, and I you know I guess there's some uh, some value in uh, in in a realistic approach there. Uh, Anyway, we're we're just outside uh, Dinnington. Uh, let's uh, let's leave our friend here. Here we are. Is, this is that's Dukinfield. It's not Dinnington. What the hell are you talking about? Uh, just outside Dukinfield, which is exactly what I just said. Um, and uh, we're looking at, uh, at different options when it comes to expansion. We haven't uh, we haven't been back here. This is where we started our our playthrough, uh, Dukinfield. Um, yeah, we, we haven't really done anything to this since we first started. We're still rolling with this incredibly hellish uh, junction system going around here, which bleeds off so much speed it just isn't funny. Is this, is this chap heading up? No, he's, he's not. He's, he's not heading up there. Anyway, this is all working. Uh, in the last couple of episodes, it seems like everybody who had a comment, the comment was, uh, I'm terrible at signalling. That's just not true, friends. I occasionally make a signaling effort, uh, a, a signaling error, but uh, but very rarely is the signaling absolutely woeful. And the uh, I'm going to talk about that before we get onto the the second part of this because they're two, they're kind of related. Uh, so if we take this signal here, now it's highly conceivable that this train that had just entered the station could get held at this signal, thereby blocking this set of points. This is a, uh, a, you know, a major, a major bone of contention for several people, and um, yes, that's absolutely true. That could indeed happen, um, but due to the way that the, uh, the the traffic comes in here, it's the, for my money, it's the most sensible approach to uh, to traffic management. Normally, what I'll do is I'll, I'll block traffic before they get to the point so that people can get there. I've got another one here that's going to block traffic, but the thing is, there's only two bits of track down here. You know, what am I, what am I supposed to do? Um, there's, that, you know, there's, there's not a massive amount of choice. That said, you know, there is plenty of room for improvement. And why is this guy currently held? Oh, it's because they were, because that one was going over the points. It works, uh, despite the fact that some may say that it is a, a particularly ugly solution. But there you go. That's uh, so. So that's that covered. You're all wrong. I'm right. It works just fine. Stop griping. Now, the second major change in this patch. I'm I'm curious to see if this is going to work. Uh, apparently, I can now put cross switches in. Oh yeah. So oh, let's let's do one over here. I've got the money, right? So you've got. Uh, let's put a reasonable length bit of track, and we'll put another bit next to it. Uh, I'm not entirely sure that's going to be long enough, but there you go. Uh, no, 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 you're not. You don't want to play the game. Come on. So I'm going to need these tracks to, to clip together for this to work because we're going to be dealing with points. So if I wanted to put a, a crossover here, right, we'll give that plenty of sp space to do so. And then apparently I can do the same back in the opposite direction to create a, a straight crossover. But I'm not seeing how that's. Uh, that's going to work. Now, I'm pretty sure I've had the patch applied. Yeah, you see, it doesn't want to do it. Okay, all right. I'll, 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 no, no, yes, no, no, no. Maybe I'm missing something. Maybe there's a maybe there's a new track upgrade thing going on. Just clicking buttons randomly is not helping. 
I'm not seeing it. Okay, right. Well, apparently it's it's possible to now uh, to do uh, crossover bits of track. What if I were to click on this in a random fashion? All right, I'm going to go and have a. In fact, I'm going to go and have a look at how, at how to do that, and then uh, and then I'll be right back. Please hold. There we go. It does work. Uh, yes, look at that magnificent beast. Um, and now, fundamentally, that's going to represent uh, you know a magnificent way of, of saving space when. Uh, doing my station approaches. Uh, I'll just show you how I managed to get that done. I, I was on the, the right track, pun unintentional, uh, but uh, for some reason it wasn't working. Right, so you uh, you bang your, uh, your points in as per usual, and then you look for the snap point at the end, and then you keep dragging down until it says, yes sir, and there you go. Uh, the stuff I'll spend the money for the sake of example. And there we go. Look, look at that. Look, fabulous. Uh, now, I mean, that's going to make life a hell of a lot easier when it comes to, uh, you know, traffic sorting. But uh, I guess at some point I'll go back and, and retrospectively fit it to the stuff that I've already got. I think that's that's quite a sensible move. But uh, let's let's get on with some actual progress now, shall we? Uh, how does that sound? Right. Let's let's recap recap for for everybody who's. Uh, who's in need of a recap, not least of all myself. So, for the last couple of episodes, we've been working on Dronfield, and uh, and Dronfield's coming along quite nicely. Uh, you know, passenger numbers not quite picking up to an extreme amount just yet, but they are picking up. Uh, as you can see, if you've been tuning in regularly, uh, we, we've only just started growing along here. Uh, there's been some discussion that, uh, that we're going to need... Uh, additional bus services in order to really drive passengers out to uh, out to the station in order to make sure that we're maximising passenger revenue. Very good point, um, and I think we'll do that possibly next episode. But uh, I did say that we're going to leave Dronfield for the time being and uh, and go look elsewhere. So we've got Letchworth, Dinnington, both being serviced already. Uh, let's turn cargo off. No, cargo is off. You've just got an awful lot of lights of the signalling variety. How can I be bad at signalling when my, my number of signals is extensive? Uh, yeah, so Dronfield also hits Borehamwood, also hits Ilford, also hit... Did I get it round to Thong? I did not get it round to Thong, but I might do at some point. Um, but what I want to identify is where I'm going to stick my second uh, hub city. I think Dukenfield's a given. I think Dukenfield's definitely a hub city. But that's going to require extensive redevelopment so uh, so I'll probably hold back on that for the moment I like Red Hill as a as a prospect uh, that buys us routes into Ilford Borehamwood also Nailsworth Duke Infield is also potential and then further afield you know Worksop Redcar Grisborough and uh, and Seaford you know there's that okay sold I'm going to stop talking start doing there we go right What's uh, what's occurring here? What's what's the problem, chaps? Red Hill Steel. This is this is not. Uh, where are we going? We're going off piste already. Uh, where are we? Red Hill Steel. Okay, maybe it's the wrong type of truck. No, you're dropping off. So you're supposed to be going out to Boreham Wood East. Yeah, look, here's, here's, the, here's the route, Borum Wood. And then it just stops. No, this is Borum Wood East. No, that's Borum Wood Central. No, oh, 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 look, here we go, there we go. Yeah, uh, Borum Wood East, right here, look. That's very strange. And you're still... Details, what's going on? What's your problem? Yeah, I mean, obviously you're not going to make me any money if you're not flaming moving. What's the, what's the, what's your, what's your dilemma? You, the, the, the route seems to be happy enough. Overview. Let's, uh, because, you know, either one of these has got an attitude problem or it's all of them. Huh. Hmm. Oh, hello, new buttons. Stop, reverse. Go to depot. Set line. Uh, Red Hill Steel. 
and, and like that, it just starts going. Very strange. You're stuck now as well. Set line. Red Hill still. I have a feeling that when they said that maybe it's trucks that need properly assigning. So maybe I'm going to have to do this to all my trucks. I ought to, I ought to do a quick investigation of this. This is a potential misread of my, on my part uh, of, the, uh, of, the, of the update. Okay, right. Those chaps are now rolling. Huh. Intriguing. Because, you know, we can't, we can't have a situation where we've got trucks jammed up. Let's have a look over here. What have we got? Yep, more jams. Okay. You're on Dromfield Iron. Well, tell you what, how about... No, you're going. Yeah, very wise on your part. You were about to get executive intervention going on there. What about you? You're good too. Maybe I just need to call up the truck details. Let's see if this guy leaves of his own accord. No, look, he's waiting for me to click him. How very strange. All right, I'm not sure what that's all about, but uh, okay, we're going we're to take a you know fixing the trucks moment here. Now I'm assuming that this is only going to happen the first time. John Field, and either that or he's just waiting for a while. Everybody else seems to be happy enough. Right, let's go find the next one. Uh, here we go. How are you doing? Everything happy here? Let's uh, let's see what we got. Dropped off some goods, picked up some nothing. I wonder if he was supposed to pick something up there. Well, we'll see in in short order. Okay, well, right. I, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna procrastinate anymore by by observing that. I'm just gonna keep half an eye out for any other truck stalling kind of scenarios that we might have going on. So we seem to be we seem to be operating okay out of there. How strange. Okay, right, good. Right, where was I going? Red something. Red Hill. Right, okay, so Red Hill. Um, now, already this town has built up to the extent that it's not going to just let me bang down a bit of track without some uh, some negotiation first. And, uh, you know, once I've got this initial setup going, uh, I am probably going to need to uh, uh, invest in, in more goods coming in. Now, I think... There you go. You're going to feel this. Uh, here we go. We've got a four-track, max length, straight on the end here. How do you feel about that? I feel good about it, so I'm, I'm doing it. Uh, why straight on the end? No, I mean, I've already identified Ilford and Boreham Wood as, uh, <clears throat> as, as targets, but, uh, yeah, look, you see, I want a bit of road in there. I, I, don't, I don't need this bit so much. What I do want is I want a, a nice, you know, platform, platform, station, avenue, road, street. Strasser kind of a idea. Okay, I'll put that in there and I'll extend, extend that in a moment. Okay, so we've got you know our easy targets: Dukenfield, Nailsworth, Ilford. Ilford's going to be our first, our first hit. Uh, then we've got Boreham Wood over there, and then we've got Seaford here. There's probably someone over there as well. Then we've got Gwisborough. So this is really the the, the easiest, uh, the easiest route to do. Now, before I even start mucking about any further, let's uh, let's get the high-speed update on there. You appear to be highlighted in green. That's a, uh, that feels like a, a bug to me, or unless that's that's performing as it was always intended to perform. Anyway, uh, I've got a train update to do as well. Uh, I did just before starting recording. I got a, a notification that. Uh, Train 4. No idea which one Train 4 is, but Train 4 is in need of, uh, of uh, replacement. So I'll have a look at that soonish. It's, it's all go, frankly, at the moment. Uh, there's, there's a lot going on. Now, I'm going to run... Uh, you know, here we go. We've got Ilford and, uh, and Boreham Wood here. So our two kind of adjoining uh, to the existing network stations... Grammatically, that wasn't a brilliant sentence, but I think you know what I mean. Um, really? Why do you want to 
do you really want to build a bridge there? I'd I'd say that that was that was excessive. All right, I don't like what you're doing to the road, so let's let's do something to the road. Let's uh, let's stop the game for a sec. Right, get my track running through here like a whippet. Seriously, so what's what's with all this? What's this, what's with this bridge? Now, I don't want to make this this angle wrong, so let's uh, let's start the other end up off as well, which is probably not before time. In fact, look at this. But I've I've already planned for extension here. How exciting is that? Uh, let's get the upgrades done. Oh, that's nice. Okay, cool. Right, so it, it shows up green if that if the piece of track is already upgraded. Oh, maybe this will mean it's going to be a doddle to find bits that I've missed. Oh, that'll be fun. That'll be one of my least favourite parts of the game kind of taken away forever. I can't say I'll be that sad to see it go. Right, uh, let's... It's no use pressing B to call up the bulldozer. You're not playing cities now, dear boy. Right, here we go. Uh... All right, so we'll peel this side over. And that, that sounds quite clinical, but uh, y you know what I mean. Uh, right, let's try and get... If we try and get you round so that you have a tight curve there, because that's an approach, so it doesn't really matter if you bleed off speed. Maybe I'll do something magnificent with uh, with crossings in this section. But, uh, no, 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 no. Let's, uh, let's not do anything like that for the moment. Right, and then let's see where's our uh, existing track. Here we go. Right. What have you done? You've built a ugly, ugly, ugly bit of bridge. You know, if there was one change that I wish they would make, it would be, uh, you know, allow me to keep using stone bridges, because stone bridges are just glorious to look at. But, I mean, that could be because I really quite like the Industrial Revolution. All right, so we've started going uphill here, and frankly, I don't want to do that, so let's crop that back. How far did you just delete? It wasn't necessary for you to delete all of it. Oh, you fussy, flaming game. Right, let's keep it on the flat. 130, and then we can go a bit faster than 130. Let's, let's go for 300 here. And we don't want to go uphill. We, we want to go downhill, given that the, the town we're aiming for is a lower elevation than this one. So if we uh, if you see 160, I don't want to go at 160. I want to go, you know, give it, give it the beans. Do not build a bridge. I'm quite happy to have a hectic slope, but Bridges is bridges is out. And it's only because bridges are unattractive. That's I mean that's the only reason that I have anything against them. A, you know, a, a well fitted bridge to a you know a mountain pass or over a river or anything along those lines is a is a glorious thing to behold. But uh, just for crossing the landscape, I uh, I don't approve. Right, okay, let's link this one up there, and hopefully that should be a smoothish curve. It is a smoothish curve. And then we'll leave the other one. I'm going to go straight for, for double training on this, despite the fact that it's going to be unprofitable for a, a fair shake of time. Because uh, I want to... I think I've, I've reached the point now where I want to to do as much kind of fire and forget uh, setup as possible, so that we can get more set up in less time. I really hope this is the right side of the track. I'm pretty certain it's the right side of the track. It's the right side of the track, look. See, it's intentional. All right, good. So that's all in all, uh, not the worst piece of track design ever. Now, on the station approach, we're coming into one side of the platform. So actually, 
actually we can go in there and this is actually this is going to work quite well i don't need to put any any crossovers of any variety at all where we we don't need to to muck about with the new technology there well that's good uh right let's get the roads plumbed back in probably going to need to crop that bit i think I'd, I'd rather have it go under than uh no that's tram uh under than over actually i'm 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 ambivalent i can go either way there we go. But there is something majestic about the tunnel. Uh, right. Actually, this is using this kind of major, major highway. There is is probably overkill. Still, there you go. Uh, and let's while we're here, let's upgrade that as well. Lovely. Of course, I don't think there's actually any traffic using this stuff at the moment. Uh, there will be in the future. But but right now I think it's uh, this is this is me just building for the sake of building. Oh, let's bang that on there, and then uh, actually I need a bit more space than that. Road, road, and right under we go. Lovely. Yeah, all right. I'm a sucker for tunnels. What can I tell you? Uh, largely because I. If you can get a, a, a bridge to work well, uh, such that you can not only get you know a bit of train track and a bit of road underneath, but more road underneath, and, and, and the pillars accommodate multiple bits and pieces, it's, it's fantastic. But very rarely can you actually get that to work. Okay, smashing. I'm going to wrap it up there for now. Uh, what I'm going to do while you're away is I'm going to do the same thing out to Boreham Wood, and I won't buy any trains. We'll do that together as a team next time you're here. Anyway, thanks very much for watching today. I've been Colonel Failure. Tune in next time for more of the same. We're going to get uh, going to get Red Hill on the map. So I think what we'll do is we'll get our passenger trains running, I'll upgrade the train that's missing, and uh, we'll look to get some more goods on the go. And right now, I see that oil is our pal. So uh, it's going to be oil. Tune in then, see what happens. Thanks for watching. Cheerio. This, 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 this.